The level of awareness that I had for Duran Duran when I was growing up would have been you know, colossal in that sense. I mean, you know, they were everywhere. The first 12 inch record I ever bought was the Reflex. I remember walking into a record shop and asking for the Reflex, um, and the guy behind the store said, Do you want the 7 inch or the 12 inch? And I, and I so was like, What's the difference? He goes, Well, 12 inch is, is longer and, and better. I was like, Okay, yeah, I'll take the 12 inch then, please. I'm glad I did because it was just really mind blowing. You know, I mean, I must have been like 10 or something, 9 or 10 at the time. That was not my first exposure to Duran because obviously I was aware of Save a Prayer and those singles previous to the Reflex. I've never grown tired of hearing some of those songs. They're, they're like very, very old friends who you're always pleased to see. I put that down to there being an atmosphere and a spirit and a mystery to those records. Those have been an education to me, not just in making records, but they would have informed how I listen to music and what I get from it as well, my expectations from it. That's my story with Gerard, basically. That's what it did to me.